The National Youth Service Corps has reiterated its commitment towards mapping out strategies to improve the quality performance of the scheme mandate in promoting national unity, cohesion and integration. The Director General of the scheme, Yishai Hamad, stated this at the 2023 Batch B Pre-Orientation Course Workshop in Kaduna, Northwest Nigeria. With the theme, Repositioning the NYC Orientation Course, in the post-Golden Jubilee era for effective national service. Kaduna State Governor Ubasani, who was represented by the Permanent Secretary of the Ministry of Education, Aliru Soba, commended the scheme for mentoring and nurturing youth to be self-reliant. The is a forum where the officials of the NYSE and other partner agencies convert to review the conduct of previous orientation courses with a view to mapping out strategies for improved performance. We are working closely with different stakeholders towards engaging, towards ensuring the success of the 2023 but be orientation course. As was the case with previous workshops, this forum will come up with far reaching resolutions and especially issue policy guidelines for the smooth conduct of the exercise. We are confident you know, the states have been providing accommodation for, for, for core members under their orientation. And um, particularly during, the, uh, during this time of insecurity that you have mentioned, we have actually moved them from um, their permanent site to our, uh, one of our secondary schools in order to, to actually to protect the, the, the core members in view of the security situation of the state. Uh, the second main is, is actually contributing uh, possibly to the success of the program since its inception. Uh, you know, to provide the necessary welfare for core members. And after their orientation, if they are posted to, uh, to, to our, uh, uh, our secondary schools or our uh, ministries, make sure that we, we, we take care of, of their welfare and other things. The DGNYC appealed to the federal government and relevant stakeholders to continue supporting the scheme for its sustenance. We call on other stakeholders to give faith to the scheme as we strive towards the transformation of our graduate youth for national development. We appreciate the federal government for its continued support, especially through the prompt release of funds for the scheme's operations. And it only comes state governments, security agencies, traditional rulers, and other stakeholders for their immense support and contributions. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.